What's up, New York Cash? Y'all already know what time it is. We finna hop into this Rick Ross situation. You dig what I'm saying? So his audience, Rick Ross audience, basically came on to his page and basically been commenting like crazy, whatever the case, that he had he got enough of that shit. You know what I'm saying? And so basically, what happened was Rick Ross was speaking up. His audience was basically asking him about the Cardi B situation. The Cardi B live video and basically what she had did before, you know what I'm saying, she had the music stuff actually going for her and, you know what I'm saying, clout and all this extra stuff, you know what I'm saying? Y'all don't know what, what that video was consisted of. It's basically things that she did before, you know what I'm saying, whatever the case. And they obviously wasn't the best thing to do, but it was stuff that she just adapted to because that's all she knew and nobody was helping her out. You know what I'm saying? Something, some, something, somebody in the trenches would have did normally. You know what I'm saying? On some G stuff, though. You dig what I'm saying? So, look, basically, Rick Ross basically was like, obviously, you know what I'm saying? Chill out. Like, y'all got to think about this. A lot of people do stuff when they're in the trenches just to make it. You know what I'm saying? Just to make it through another day because everybody in the trenches really looking out for their own self, most part. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody really out there like, Oh shoot! They got a they. You know what I'm saying? They have a problem with their rent, or they got a problem with the lights this this month. You know what I'm saying? Or this, this you know what I'm saying? Everybody got their own situations, so you can't really expect people to be like, "Oh shoot, I'm gonna go help them out." Because if you actually living in the trenches, that you barely making it too. Think about that. If you got everybody in the same area that's struggling, nobody nobody can help it. Nobody can help nobody. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, maybe a couple people. You know what I'm saying? Living there that actually, you know what I'm saying, make a little more. But, you know what I'm saying? Obviously, they got things that they want and aspirations and goals and stuff like that. Uh, comment down below how y'all feel about this situation, man. Shout out to Rick Ross for speaking up and actually saying something on his behalf. You know what I'm saying? And like, I'm subscribing until next time. You dig? Uh. me with this Cardi B shit, right? But I'm going to tell you this. You know, I'm explain something to you. Leave Cardi B alone. And the reason I tell you that is... In a lot of circumstances, that's what come with that lifestyle. She never hid that. We all know that. Fortunately, I'm from Miami and I understand that. My circumstances and my incidents, where I did lose a seven-figure deal, were Reebok. And I took that to the chin and I have no love lost for Reebok. You understand? Because I needed to understand I was a king. You understand? And they right. I didn't need to promote that. Scared to go home. Cause my mama I'ma take mine and put it up I got some foreign baddies in my deal that hear me and subscribe I don't know what are you waiting for I don't know if you're waiting for me to just gain a hundred billion K I don't know what I just said but <laughs>